Does anyone know what a bass trap is? No, who no. Tell us, Mr. Audio. In order to deaden a room, that is to make a room less reverberant, several techniques can be employed. Making the walls non-parallel and using diffusers to eliminate standing wave patterns is helpful. Deadening can also be achieved by addressing the wall surfaces. Materials like fiberglass and roxel insulation placed on the walls can absorb sound and prevent it from being reflected. Anechoic foam like Sonics, Arlex, and others are also helpful in absorbing sound. However, even though applying these materials directly to a wall will absorb most frequencies, they're usually not thick enough for the longer wavelengths, so they're not as effective at low frequencies. One way to absorb low frequencies without having to extend the insulation far out into the room like in an anechoic chamber is to use a base trap. It works like this. Pieces of drywall or particle board are each surrounded by a wrap of fiberglass, roxel, or other sound absorbing material. These pillows of insulation are then hung from the ceiling perpendicular to the nearest wall several inches apart. They're suspended on wires so that they can freely move. They're usually hidden by a soffit that's covered by acoustical fabric. The low frequency waves pass through the fabric and strike the sound deadening material. Then, since the panels not only have some depth, but can also actually move slightly when disturbed by the sound waves, the low frequency is nearly completely absorbed instead of being reflected back into the room. Thanks, Mr. Audio. For more interesting facts about sound, visit Mr. Audio at soundimages.com.